Hi there and welcome to this video in the IBM Cloud Foundation Skill Series and in this video we're going to uh, just have a very quick overview of uh, VPC Gen 2. Now um, those of you that have been using the IBM Cloud for a little while and you've been looking at uh, VPC um, you'll notice that uh, we now have Gen 1 or Generation 1 and uh, Gen 2. So um, these are uh, two slightly different offerings although they are very much the same. Um, all of the videos that um, I've recorded up to this point um, are actually based on uh, based on Gen 1, but I'm not going to go and re-record all of those for Gen 2 because effectively um, they both operate in exactly the same way. So the main uh, so the main difference really between the between the two, and I'll show you this in the next slide, um, is effectively um, around networking performance and uh, fast provisioning times. So if we have a, a quick look at the building blocks uh, for both Gen 1 and Gen 2. Um, you can see that Gen 1 is uh, is based on our, our classic, what we call classic hardware uh, and the, the classic network infrastructure. So if you are running um, virtual machines using our, our classic offerings, then effectively that VPC is, is built on the same hardware um, as, as, those, as those classic offerings. Um, it also uses the same orchestration plane as well, so a classic orchestration plane. So typically, um, it, whilst it seems to be uh, uh, quicker to provision services um, under VPC than it does um, under classic services, it is actually still using the same orchestration plane. So compared to Gen 2, it's actually, um, it's actually quite a bit slower. So uh, with Gen 2, uh, we're using brand new hardware, so it's our next generation um, hardware which has been developed specifically for, uh, for VPC and uh, it's also using brand new networking infrastructure as well. So that networking infrastructure, whereas with Gen 1 it will go up to around about um, 12 gigabits per second, under Gen 2 you're looking at up to 80 gigabits per second, so the, uh, so the underlying networking is, is far, far quicker. So again, it's built across the same regions at the time of recording. Um, it's not in quite as many regions as Gen 1, but by, uh, certainly by the middle of 2020 and beyond, um, it will be a, a, a available in all the avail availability zones that Gen 1 is available in. Uh, and as I mentioned, it also uses our next gen orchestration plane. So that orchestration plane means that um, when you now provision services in Gen 2, uh, rather than waiting two or three minutes for your virtual machine to create, or um, up to around about 15 minutes, I think, for a, um, for a load balancer to create, you're talking about 30 seconds for, uh, for your average virtual machine and around about two minutes for um, for things like a load balancer. So it's far, far quicker in terms of orchestration. Now, both of them also use a, a brand new infrastructure API. Um, I haven't talked about that yet in any of the other videos, but, but uh, I may well record a video on that um, fairly shortly too, so we can have a look at the, the API if you want to code some of this stuff. So a lot of the customers at the moment are asking which version of VPC they should actually be using. And the basic answer um, is probably Generation 2, Gen 2, wherever possible. And that's because it's faster and it's also based on the latest technology. Though having said that, both Gen 1 and Gen 2 currently have the same functionality. They both work in exactly the same way. Um, they're both available in the same MZRs, or at least they will be. Um, currently at the time of recording, this is January 2020, um, Gen 2 is only available in Dallas, um, whereas uh, Gen 1 is available across the globe. That should um, should have changed by certainly by the middle of 2020, and I know that uh, within a few weeks of this video being recorded, um, Gen 2 will be rolled out to at least one or two other um, MZRs across the across the the globe. Gen 2 is uh, is going to continue to be developed, so new services are likely to go to Gen 2. Um, rather than Gen 1. So again, if you want to uh, make sure that you're um, able to uh, take advantage of the latest services, uh, then Gen 2 is, is the place to be. Um, as we've already looked at, Gen 2's fast provision and also Gen 2's underlying network is far faster. So, um, so if you're building something right now, if it's something that's say development or test, or you're doing a proof of concept using, um, using VPC, then Gen 1 will, will do the job for you and Gen 1 will probably be a good place to go. Um, but if you're looking at something which is going to uh, be longer term and also be, uh, be, be of a production use, then Gen 2 is probably um, the place to be, um, assuming of course that uh, you can place it into the right MZR. 
Okay, so in the next video, what I'm going to do is actually build a VPC using Gen 2. And uh, this is the architecture that I'm going to build out. So this is uh, effectively a load balanced website that will run across um, two different zones within the, uh, within the Dallas region. So what you should see from that video is that uh, Gen 1 and Gen 2 pretty much look the same. Uh, they generally have the same functionality. Uh, but what you should see is that um, I'm, I'm pretty much building it in real time. So the length of the video is actually the length of time that it actually took me to uh, to actually build the services. And bearing in mind that I'm also talking whilst I'm uh, whilst I'm doing the building, you can probably uh, knock five or ten minutes off the uh, the total time of that video. So you can see again that you know it takes an awful lot less time uh, to provision services within Gen Two compared to Gen One, uh, and also it's uh, you know it's a good place to go and build things quickly and securely. Okay, and that's the end of this video, so hopefully you've enjoyed it and it's been useful. Um, as always, if you'd like to subscribe to my channel, that would be great. But in the meantime, I'll, uh, I'll see you next time. Thank you very much.